All right, so this is a pretty quick, short um, example. So one common task uh, is to merge data layers into a single file, right? So uh, for example, if you have a bunch of points in Ohio and a bunch of points in West Virginia, you may want to merge those into a single file that contains both sets of points. So note that that's different than a union. And in the case of a union, you're actually performing like um, geometric overlays and whatnot. Here you're just simply merging files. So this is less of an analysis and more of like a data management process. All right, so here I have three shapes and they're all stored in three and they're stored in three separate files. So let's say I wanted to make a single file to store all three of these shapes. All right, so to do that, we get a vector and then data management tools and then what we want to do is merge vector layers. Okay, and then uh, so we want to list the layers we want to merge. Um, so it's just grabbing the stuff from the layers list. You can also, I believe, search or add from files. You know, it doesn't have to be loaded in. So I'm just going to grab the polygon, so the circle, rectangle, and triangle. Adds those to the list there. You can change the transformation if you want. Um, we'll just leave it. Uh, we'll, leave, we'll use that one there. And then it's going to generate a temporary file. Okay, so there we go. So this is our merged object that contains all three of these features. And if we go into the attribute table here, we can see that there's three features there and they're no, they haven't been like combined in any way. It's just simply storing them all as separate features. Okay, so that's how you do a merge um, in QGIS.